Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Arbuckle, and today I am very excited because I'm officially on winter break, Christmas break, Hanukkah break, whatever you want to call it now. Um, I haven't had school for like the last week. I haven't had to go. I didn't have any classes, but today I actually had to take my last final for biology, which took about an hour this morning. Uh, but I'm officially done. I'm game over, man. Game over. Semester complete. I win. Um, actually, <laughs> in some cases, I don't win. But anyway, uh, <laughs> I can't wait because I've got like three, four weeks of just absolute. I've got like a month of just nothing. No school whatsoever. No, no stress. I'm excited. I'm really hyped. Uh, but today was actually a very stressful day because on the way home, well, the morning I had to go take the exam. So I wake up. You know, I'm trying to study. I'm cramming in last second. You know. Go to take the exam, finish up with the exam. I leave it like, what's up? I'm done. <laughs> on the way home, um, I'm going to go home and I'm going to get my check and I'm going to go to the bank, right? So on my way home, I'm passing like cops after cops after cops running radar. It was unbelievable. Normally, you know, you get lucky if you see one cop running radar somewhere, you know? <laughs> and I wouldn't say lucky because sometimes you get pulled over and you're unlucky. Uh, but sometimes you'll only see like one cop. And if you're really lucky, you'll, you might see two. Today, on my way home from work, I passed... Two cops, all right, two, and I knew where they were, so I was like, all right, I'm going to go home, get my check, go back to the bank, and then come home, and I'll be done for the day, so I'm on my way home, past the two cops, get my check, uh, get back in the car, and I'm heading back to the bank, so on my way to the bank, I know where two of these cops are, on the way to the bank, I kid you not, dude, freaking ridiculous, I passed four cop cars running radar in like a 12-minute trip from my house to the bank. That is ridiculous. That is way too many police running radar. That's not including the cop that always has his car set up to make it look like he's running radar when he's off duty so that people slow down. And the three cop cars that I passed coming out of Oki's funeral home and the funeral, posse funeral possession, which is unbelievable. I passed like eight cop cars on a 12-minute trip to the bank. It was unbelievable. But it gets better. So, two of the cops that I knew where they were, I was good. I went through like three of them with no problem. But there was one. There was one city cop who was sitting at a gas station that I always go to. And on the way home, before I got my check, he had pulled someone over. And I saw him. I saw him. He had pulled someone over. He was talking to him at their window. So, I was like, all right, that guy is in the pulling over mood. I got to be careful. So, when I'm coming back, you know, I'm like, all right, he's going to be down there. I got to be careful. I got to slow down. Well, I got to that point in my head where I started thinking about something else. And you guys know what I'm talking about when you're riding down the road and all of a sudden, you know, you start thinking about something. You're not paying attention how fast you're going. You're not speeding on purpose. You're not trying to get a ticket. But, you know, you're, you're focused on something else. You're thinking about what you're going to do for the rest of the day. You think about what you're going to have for dinner tonight or what you're going to do. And you're not paying attention. Well, and then all of a sudden you look up and you see a cop and you're like, oh. So that's pretty much what happened. I was, I was riding down the road. I knew the cop was going to be there, but all of a sudden my mind went elsewhere. And I wasn't paying attention. And I'm riding down the road and all of a sudden, you know, my mind just stops. And I, I see the cop car and my whole brain just stops. And I look down at the, the speedometer and I'm going 10 over. And I kid you not, man, when I was parallel with his car passing him, his, he turned his lights on. As soon as I went past him, he turned his lights on. I knew I was going 10 over. I was like, oh, my God, I just got pulled over. So before he even pulled out, I pulled over on the side road and waited. I parked on the side of the road, rolled down my window, and was like, all right, I might as well sit here and like look like a good person so that he knows that I knew I was speeding, and maybe I'll get out of the ticket. I wait like three minutes. The guy never showed up. He never came after me. I was like, well, maybe he went after someone else, but I never saw him go by. He couldn't have. So I pull back out like five minutes later, and I come up to the little intersection where I'm about to keep heading to the bank. And I look back, and the cop car is still at the gas station with his lights on. He never pulled out. I don't know if he... I think what happened was he either had a call that he decided not to go for, or he accidentally hit the, the light switch with his, with his knee because it's right there on the bottom. But, you know, I, I don't know. I was very lucky. I was like, are you serious? I knew he was there the whole way, and I still got pulled over. But I got lucky. I didn't get pulled over, and I kept going to the bank. Funny thing is, on the way back from the bank, that exact cop had pulled over another person. So I was that lucky guy in between <laughs> that didn't get pulled over. But I was willing to bet that he pulled over like 20 people today at least. That guy was on a roll. But that's all I really want to talk about. I want you guys. I wanted to share you guys. I did get a ticket one time, though. I really, uh, actually, I did not get a ticket one time. Wow, I, I didn't even think of that. One time, I, I got. I've only gotten pulled over one time, uh, which was like uh, several months ago over the summer. Um, but I didn't get a ticket. I got lucky. I got out of it. So that is very fortunate. But I'll tell you guys that story in another video. Um, I'm really excited. Like I said, I'm on vacation now. I'm going to 
Oh my god, guys, you guys are going to love some videos. I've got some hilarious videos lined up that are going to come out over winter break. Uh, so you, the next couple of days, guys, you guys better expect some awesome videos and a lot of videos. So um, I'm really excited. We're going to be playing some zombies tonight. If I, if I knew how to live stream, I would. But, you know, there's probably not enough of you guys to watch it anyway. But um, playing some zombies, we're going to try to beat my town solo record, which is 53. We got to 45 the other night and died, but we're going to try to beat 53 so I can get top 1,000 in the world. And then we're going to go play some Call of the Dead on Black Ops 1 with some friends later. So uh, hopefully we'll have some cool videos coming out for you guys. Hope you guys did enjoy the video, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. See ya.